congratulations on the victory. It looked like it was one that was pretty important to you. You could tell that yeah, the emotion was there after the fight. Can you t explain to us why it was so important to you, this one? Very emotional. Uh, so I've had not an easy run. Uh, my first three fights were very, very tough opponents. Um, I get Tisha Torres for my very first fight coming in. Uh, and I knew this was my fourth fight on my contract, so this is my last one, and I made a lot of changes uh, coming into this camp. I moved from Washington to Texas, and I, to me, I came to the greatest team in the world uh, with the best people. Um, I've got the best training partners, trained my ass off, and I wasn't even expecting to fight this early coming into uh, Fortis, but uh, Safe got me a fight, and uh, yeah, I just feel like, you know, mentally, I was at 100%. Uh, physically, I feel like uh, my cardio was there, everything there was there. Uh, I've had some injuries in this camp, uh, but my heart was there, my mind was there, and I was firing all, on all cylinders. So uh, it's very emotional for me. It feels good to get that win. Uh, you know, this is the biggest stage in the world, uh, and to get a win in the, that octagon is is the best feeling in the world. So. Yeah, a lot of emotions for me right now. You mentioned your will. I mean, she started strong, right? But yeah. you managed to come back on. And, and, and um, I'm curious, how important mentally was it for you when you saw her get the point deduction? Did that make you think like, oh, okay, I can I can win this. Now I can really push on and get something here. I, I knew I was going to win regardless of the point deduction. Um, I knew my momentum was gaining um, and I felt really good. Uh, for me, it was just the, uh, you know, the principle of it that uh, – you know, I had four eye pokes, and now finally she got that point deducted. So for me, it was basically just, you know, they respected the rules, and you know, um, yeah, because it was that same left eye. So uh, yeah. Was it bothering you the eye pokes? A little bit, yeah, but it's it is what it is. You know, it's a fight. You said that you felt like you were going to win. Judges can be a bit quirky, we'll say, in this sport. Did you feel confident when it was going to the judges' school cards? Uh, yeah, I did. I knew, um, especially with those two takedowns and the dominant um, uh, position that I had, I knew uh, that I had won. Uh, regardless of the first first round, uh, Safe even told me, he was like, you lost that first round. <laughs> and I knew, uh, you know, and that's what I love, that he's just so brutally honest. And he's like, this is exactly what's going on, and this is what I need, to, need from you, and I'm going to follow the rules, and I'm exactly going to follow exactly the game plan. Whatever he tells me to do, I'm going to do it um, without any hesitation. So, uh, yeah, for me, this just means so much. I, 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 felt, I, I just feel like I sound like a broken record, but I'm just so happy right now. That's awesome. Well, congratulations. Congratulations on the changes and, and the victory. Thank you, sir. After that first round, what were some of the things they were saying to you, and was there anything going on through your mind you made all the changes, you, you, you changed camps, and then the first round didn't go your way. What did they have to say to you, and what were you feeling after that very first round? I knew that first round wasn't going to go my way. Um, I knew she was going to be extremely tough. I knew, um, you know, her potential. She's Brazilian. She's tough. Uh, she's going to come out with a lot of tricks and a lot of energy in that first round, so I just had to weather the storm. And I knew in the second round when uh, Safe was yelling at me, and he was just like, I need threes and fours out of you instead of just one punch at a time. Uh, I, I saw her take a deep breath, and I was like, she's getting tired. Uh, and that gave me momentum, and that gave me a lot of energy. Uh, and I felt, you know, the confidence in myself kind of shift. Uh, so that made me feel really good. Coming in, like you said, it was the fourth round of your, or I'm sorry, the, the fourth of your, I guess, four-fight contract. Yes, sir. Were you feeling extra pressure just even looking at those those last three losses, knowing that this would be the fight if you're, if you're able to get another contract, this is the fight that they're going to look at? Were you coming in with any extra pressure on your shoulders to, to perform out there? <laughs> That's really funny that you say that. Uh, no, I wasn't, actually, because Safe and I had a, a little heart-to-heart -heart in the gym. Uh, I kind of broke down to him and was crying and, you know, just – put it all out on the table and him and I had a conversation and he's like, you should feel no pressure. He was like, this is just to go out there and do it for you and, you know, have fun. And this was the first fight in, in a while that I've had fun, that I enjoyed myself and that I was excited to be in there and happy to be in there and uh, excited that who was in my corner. I was going to say, even just speaking of that, knowing that you were dealing with issues that made you want to change states, change camps, how much lighter and freer did you feel that you were in there? Because we know how much the mental side of the actual fight is just as big as the physicality of the fight. So I guess how much lighter and freer did you feel going into that fight? Yeah, so uh, this whole week, uh, getting, getting to Vegas, uh, 
it's just been a breath of fresh air for me. Uh, everything, we've just been joking around, we've just been lighthearted, just been, you know, we went on a hike, uh, the weight cut was super easy, everything was just fluid. Everything was exactly how it was supposed to be, and uh, I was just happy this week. I was happy to be here, I was happy to compete, um, and I think my performance showed that today, yeah. Well, even outside of this, you know, we've seen the UFC recently has let a lot of people fight out their contracts. But it feels like regardless, you've found yourself again. You've found love for the sport again. So regardless, you're going to keep working forward and, and uh, see where fighting keeps going. Hopefully, it's still in the UFC, but I hope so. you'll continue wherever. It, it, should, should they not? Or Yeah, I hope so. Um, I mean, I, I think my performance tonight, I, I think I earned another, at least one more. You know, maybe not four fights, um, but one just to show what I'm worth and show what I'm capable of. Because... I know I can have that same performance, if not a better performance, in my next fight. Uh, so I think I deserve another one. Awesome. Thank you. Congrats on the victory. Thank you so much.